Hello everybody. I just wanted to do a really short introduction on my next project that I'm going to be working on. Um, I've probably mentioned this before, but um, when my grandmother passed away a few years ago, I inherited um, a lot of stuff from uh, her art supplies. And I found in a box um, these ceramic pieces that she had kept. Um, they, now, I don't know a lot about ceramics. I did ceramics a long, long time ago as a child. Um, I, I know that they have to go through um, several firing processes in a kiln. These have already been fired, and I believe at this point they are ready for painting. And if they're not, who cares? Because I don't have a kiln, and I don't know anybody who does, so I'm either going to throw them away or I'm going to try to use them. So I thought that I would use them for a project. Um, and I'm going to start with this crab, and I've already covered this crab with uh, two coats of gesso, and it's still a little bit sticky, it's still kind of drying. Um, but I'm going to paint the crab, and as you can see, the crab is, is kind of like a little dish. So it has this lid that goes on the top, the top shell comes off and then holds some things inside. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to use um, mostly just regular acrylic paint. I may throw some sprays in there, I may put something, I might use some Perlex powders or something at some point. Um, but I've also printed out um, this picture of my son um, at the beach and I've printed it on tracing paper. I've printed it a couple times. I'm going to decide which image I like the best. Um, but I'm going to somehow incorporate it onto the back of the crab um, along with the painting. Once I get to this um, color, I'll probably attach this with um, maybe some Mod Podge or something um, and then paint around it. We'll see. Or I may not use it. I don't know. That's just an idea. Um, so I've printed out. This is not a Florida blue crab because the back legs are all wrong. However, I love the color of a Florida blue crab. And I don't know if it's showing up really well on the camera, but it's like a dark green and this, you know, just brilliant blue color. And you can see the back legs are a little bit different. They're more flattened and paddle-like than the legs on this crab. I'm going to um, I'm going to use these colors. Uh, because I just think they're really pretty. So so anyways, I just want to let you know this is what I'm going to do. At some point I'm probably going to do something with this plate too. It um, looks to me like it's some type of orchid. Um, so I don't know how I'm going to paint this. I may try to incorporate some photos onto this as well. We'll see how this works out with the crab. may actually work out better with the plate because it's um, got more of a surface to actually put photos on. Or I might just paint it and um, maybe put some pretty flowers or some kind of embellishments on it or something. I don't know yet. Um, to hang on the wall. Um, but we'll see. Um, but I just wanted to let you know um, what my plans were and um, I'm going to speed up everything that I'm doing um, like I normally do with my videos and I hope you guys enjoy this process. And um, please let me know if you have any questions. You can put them in the comment section. Thank you.